Hey yo everyone, it's Big Buku here and I got a free-for-all for you guys. And uh, this was uh, captured a little while back. It's been on my file share for uh, about a week now, a week or two. And I was kind of in a Call of Duty slump with Team Deathmatch and Domination. And I was playing a little bit today and I was just getting really aggravated. So I'm like, eh, I'll put the game down. I'm trying to, I want to get a chopper gunner for a little something that I want to do with that. But I... I mean, I got one, but it was the end of the game, and I was like, ugh. And then just the Team Deathmatch spawns, I, I can't stand them. Some days I'll, I'll roll with them, no problem, like like my Kipperus Onage video. Other days it's like, ugh, oh my gosh, I was playing Kowloon, I was getting attacked from all these angles, and I was like, come on, give me a chance. Let me build a kill streak. But yeah, so this was captured a while back, and it was around my second or third game of free-for-all ever. I hadn't played in a while. And I, like I said, I wasn't a Call of Duty slump. That's why I'm using my AK-74U silenced with Ghost. You know, the AK-74U and Ghost is noob, but whatever. I just I really wanted, like, the top class I could make, and these are arguably the best. So I figured, eh, why not? Especially for free-for-all. If you're firing unsuppressed free-for-all, you're cooked. If you're... I don't know, running Ghost is a smart choice too, but I like to run my MPL, so I mean, I have to use Scavenger, or else I run out of ammo ridiculously fast, but, which makes it a little bit challenging. I mean, I got a couple free-for-all games I want to give you guys, but anyways, this is just a free-for-all game, my second or third one ever, and I really like playing free-for-all. I'll either do really well and win, or suck, and <laughs> I mean, it's... It's the luck of the spawns, to be completely honest. It's wh whoever can, ch whoever can get from that spawn to the position of advantage, which is what I do in this building here. It just you have it such an easy time because then you get to look from each side. You get that. I mean, especially when it's like a high point of advantage, like this. I'm able to look across a majority of the map. But anyway, I don't know. I don't really have anything to talk to you guys about today except the fact that I'm kind of getting frustrated with this easy cap and that blue line on the side that's in all my videos. I mean, I downloaded a bunch of software for I was working for at least to at least 2 hours and I tried getting a <laughs> This is what I tried to do. I got a video editing software. I think it was what was it called? I forget. I totally forget. But basically I googled free software video editing whatever look at that guy he missed the knife and uh it like needed it it was the wrong format so i downloaded a converter and then i downloaded from that like another software because one didn't work and basically took everything in windows movie maker transferred it converted it put it in did the narration transferred it put it in and i was like oh. and it just, in the end it didn't work which you know <laughs> with my luck that's exactly what would have happened so why do i even bother but anyway um so that that's that. I mean, I really wish I could get better quality videos. Maybe I'd get more views, likes, subscribers, whatever. And I wish I had a good software. I mean, people use the Hoppage HD PVR, but I don't play on a high def television. That's the thing. Like I play on standard quality. I know that's kind of absurd. And uh people tell me, "Oh, you should get one in HD PVR." I'm like, "That only works for HD TVs. At least that's what I think." But yeah, I play standard definition, so I mean, this is, I guess I really can't improve the quality if that's what's coming off the TV, because I can't read people's gamer tags when I'm playing. That's really how bad it is. I don't have the money to, to buy a better TV, and I'm totally cool with playing on standard definition, but I just wish I could make my videos that much more pleasurable to watch, and if I were to get a good uh, editing software, I could maybe do some cool transitions and just cooler stuff rather than just a gameplay because I don't know like make myself a cool intro too I don't know yet but like T Martin does the jumps and spots and he has all those cool transitions and a lot of v people go into theater mode and I guess I could technically do that but like put in a clip like have me kill someone but then show it from his from like a a dolly camera or like his point of view but I just I just don't have the right software, which makes it that much more difficult. But I I do want to invest. I mean, this stuff interests me. I I'd love to have a lot of subscribers. But posting these video videos up, it's just fun to do. It's kind of like a diary. It gets stuff off my chest. But yeah, thirty two, thirty and two. Thank you. Have a good one.